Fowler is playing in the yard. This is his favorite tree. Say hello, Fowler. All right. You keep doing you keep doing yard stuff. Hey, it's Ethan. Um, welcome back to Uncle Lee's Garage. And I don't have like a big long video today, uh, but I do have kind of something that I want to show you. Um, I got my race helmet in. And I have to get to it. And I'm not going to, this, this is not an unboxing. This is not an unboxing. Um, but I do have my race helmet in. I have to grab it. Oh no. My wife. See these things? We almost made a mess here. But we did it. So that's good. But my wife is, uh, she's still got stuff in the garage. Uh, but here's the helmet. So that's good. Um, hang on. Hello, Rory. How are you, love? Helmet, check. Dog, check. He does not like being outside. He's an inside dog. What a tail. All right, so I got the helmet, and I'm going to look up also what kind of helmet it is so that you guys know that. Um, but I got it online. I'm not going to say the website because I don't particularly care about doing free advertising for people. So, so this is a, this is my helmet. Uh, it's a Zamp. So I just, I just got done saying I'm not a big free ads guy, but I'm not reviewing this and I'm not saying this is a great helmet or a good helmet or a bad helmet or any kind of helmet. It's just a helmet, uh, that I'm going to wear. I don't know if it's good or bad, so don't go out and rush and buy this helmet because I don't know. I don't know about it yet. I do know what I can tell you. I'm looking it up on eBay right now. So purchases. This is a Zamp RZ36 uh, Air. I don't know if that's part of the name or if it's just just on there. Um, but yeah, Zamp RZ36. That's this helmet. Um, and I paid $243.99 for it. So not a super expensive helmet. So that's good. So it's going to protect my head. So this is it. Let's get it out here. It's got this little pull string. The bag is okay. I mean, it's kind of, it's a bag. It's not much more than that. I have a nicer bag out there in the garage that I'll probably put it in because it was from my, it's from my go-kart days, but the helmet doesn't really match the bag. But this is it. That's her. Uh, I said I don't know a lot about racing and I know even less about helmets, but this is, it's got the tear off posts here on the side. The screw off ones it does have uh the attachments so i can get a hans device and wear hans i actually uh they make one too that's a little cheaper and i'll probably go with that lift up the helmet lens gonna need two hands for this i do believe yep nope nope just the yep kind of needed two but so there's that that's opened that's good by the way pardon all the crap we have things on our table, and that's just kind of how life is here. Uh, but this, there's, there's that. It lifts up. It's real nice. It's got little, it's got, I don't know if you can see those vents, little vents down there. Um, it's got, what else has it got? Uh, this is for the fresh air thing. And I'm not, I'm not sure what I did with that. I'm not sure what I did with that. Not sure. Uh, we'll look for that in a second. In the meantime, let's put, go ahead and put it on. Ignore the hair. I don't need your judgment. Yeah. All right. Doing it one-handed. It. I got. It. I can't do. I can't do both of these things. Yeah. So there's the helmet. It's on. It's on. Um. I don't know. I have a tripod on this camera. Never even crossed my mind to use that. Um, I don't know, man. It just seems like a good helmet so far. It's comfortable. It's not the most comfortable thing I've ever felt in my life. This padding is a. It's not really super smooth, but it'll work. I don't know. It's okay. It feels like it fits, which is nice. Of course, the fit's not really their problem. Um, the fit was on me. I got a medium, which I think is the appropriate size. It does feel like it doesn't come 
far enough down here. I'm not exactly sure how far that should go. So if you guys know, let me know. Uh, but let's go see if we can find that fresh air port because I don't know, I don't know where that's at. Came in a box. Oh, there's the box. I probably should have showed you guys that too. This is not an unboxing. This is just a, hey, I bought a helmet <laughs> video. Zamp, that's the box that comes in. Zamp, zamp, zamp box. Okay. Oh, and some paperwork. And there's this. We'll take this back inside. Let me get this thing out. So there's the fresh air port. I think that's what I'm supposed to call it. Not exactly sure about that either. But you can get, basically you can run a, um, a blower on, that's backwards. You can run a blower on your race car and it'll blow fresh air into here. Uh, one of the big things, and maybe it helps with fogging too. I've heard the side ones help with fogging a little better, but this is, uh, I got the one on top. I just think it'd be more comfortable for me. Uh, and I wouldn't have to like turn my head and all that stuff. So I got this. I'm assuming you just take, if you want to add it, you just pop these little, pop these little dudes out and then put it in there. So I might, am I gonna get a blower? I don't know, I might get a blower. It just depends on how how the track and everything feels uh, when I get there. It's gonna be the dead heat of the summer, hopefully by the time we get this car done. Um, and I have heard taking the blower and like running it inside of your race suit. Heard that's pretty good, heard it's pretty good. I don't know, but I heard it's pretty good. So anyways, yep, that is the Zamp helmet that I have purchased for racing um pretty pretty sweet looking i like it i don't like white helmets i think they look goofballish um sorry if you got a white helmet just that's what i think um they never really look good in the pictures on the cars i like a tinted visor too but i'm not really sure how that would work on dirt i know i did it in the go-kart racing world and it wasn't bad but dirt's a little different or you know dirt car racing i guess is a little different so that's it. So any tips, suggestions, anything you think about that helmet, let me know. Uh, down the road, I'll probably do a review on it um, and let you know how it goes. That's all I got until we go and get an engine. Hopefully that's done this week. Hopefully we go and get one. Um, like I say, we will see. But anyways, that's all I got. I still don't have an intro or extra. I don't have a, I don't have an outro. So, um, something creative, something fun. I love you all. Uh, pedal to the metal. Race fast. Love you. Bye.